me know with that. Like, who's next up in the queue? Let's find out. Try to scroll up here. So we got Einstein. All right. All right. Let's get him. Let's get him, Einstein. It's like, I brought you in here to stop crying, but you're just going to continue crying. Okay. So yeah, I'm just going to say trades are good. My whole idea is here. I want to just try to checkmate as fast as possible. That's the goal. So I'm going to push Harry up the board, try to dislodge this knight so I can play knight e5. You know, just try and get my pieces around his king when and where I can. Are you good? <laughs> Hello? Come here. So I'll go 95, that's the plan. Oh my god, come here. Alright, there we go. That's how you get a child. Alright, I guess I can take these out since nobody's talking in my earbuds anyways. Alright, so here I might just go... Do I want to go queen g4? He's got knight, knight f5, but then maybe I have pawn at g6 ideas, which is fun. We good? Trades are good. Yeah, this position looks pretty good. I guess he might want to go like bishop at f6 just to stop me from taking here. And if he goes bishop at f8, it's not as good because then, you know, his king's more cramped. But yeah, rook g8, I was going to say, is bad because I have pawn at h7 threat. So if I can get a pawn, it's really good for me. We'll see if my partner can grab me one. If not, then I'll just, you know what? It's probably better that I just keep moving anyways. I'm going to not sit because I have a really good attack. And pawn it, it's not even a big threat because after I take and you be captured with the knight, I still have to do the whole thing that I'm doing right now, which is trying to get in on the light squares here. So I'm going to take e6 because since this pawn is um, pinned by my bishop, I can just capture there. And that's beautiful. My partner is doing a really, really amazing job at defending against his opponent's sacrifices, which I said that when you're at a level below 1800, you don't necessarily need to know how to do it very well. But he's doing it very well, so that's very impressive. Nice job, Einstein. Alright, so he's gonna go there, isn't he? So, I'm gonna just give up my queen, because I found like a weird mating net that I think works. We'll see which way he goes. I'd let, okay, he went that way, so that's annoying. So, um, here, a knight mate. He's gonna get a knight, my opponent, but I'm gonna have to try and find, like, a weird way to mate him here, I think. Could take here. This isn't as solid and as safe as I was hoping it would be. Like, I was hoping this would be just, like, an easy checkmate, but I totally messed up. A king, g8. Yeah, he's good. My partner's safe. So, I'm gonna just... What can I do here? I might go... I might make a silly looking move to see if it works. Let's go bishop at a6. I know this move looks ridiculous, but I swear I have a plan. I don't have a plan. I swear I have a plan, don't worry. So my partner can just go king g8, I think. Oh, I should stop making moves on the board. Alright. Alright. Oh, did, did my opponent move? Oh, that's unfortunate. I didn't realize. Alright, so I just have mate. I just have mate. I didn't realize it was my move. I apologize, partner. I'm apologizing to my partner. I'm like, I'm sorry. I did not realize it was my move. That's so bad. Okay. I guess do your best to try and get up time. I just go, go, go. I'm sorry. <laughs> Please, partner. I'm sorry. 
Go, 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 go. Okay, now you can sit. You do not have to move anymore, partner. Oh my gosh, my partner's a beast. Look at that. Whoa, dude, you just survived, like, down so much time because of my poor visualization abilities. You just survived down time, like, down a queen. That's freaking, that's epic. Nice job. What? How did you do that? That's epic. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Nice.